stealing your friend. <laughs> your mouth is all licky and slobbery. <laughs> you have so much forelock. Is there a little cucumber there? Hmm? Is there a little cucumber there? Yeah. You're so tiny. Hello everybody, this is me and I'm currently just giving Duke some scratchies which he looks like he is really enjoying. So this is actually Duke's first ever time in the wash bay so you know, big step for him but he's been doing so well and I've just been giving him a bit of a groom so he's looking very cute right now. His mane always looks so much fluffier when I give it a brush so it's looking all nice and neat at the moment. But anyway, I have had the most busy horsey weekend ever and I vlogged the whole thing so I have taken you guys with me so I went to the Pony Magazine big day out that was actually supposed to happen back in April 2020 so that got pushed back quite a lot because of the strange couple of years we've had um, but that was so much fun and oh my goodness I really missed meeting you guys so it was really lovely to see everybody and also to everyone who came to Blenheim as well that was the day after and that was really busy as well but oh my goodness so much fun so let me take you guys back to Saturday morning very early in the car on the road on the way to Meris Woods good boy I have now arrived and we're here at Meriswood. Look at the arena. It's huge. So there, I think there's about 600 people coming here today, which is very exciting. I'm currently just having a look around all the pop-up shops before it gets too busy in here, but I thought I'd take you around. So everybody's just currently setting up. I'm not gonna lie, it feels like we're at the beach because we're on sand. So, you know. <laughs> Um, but it's so surreal seeing everything up in a shop. I've missed like doing shows and things so much So it's really nice to see everything in person. So exciting. So I've got to do my meetup soon But before I thought I'd go and say hi to everybody in the queue Hi <laughs> See you guys later <laughs> going behind the scenes Oh, what's in here? Ah, oh, cool we have the snack table. <laughs> Meet up time. <gasps> Got my little background, water, and signing cards, and of course, a lot of Sharpies. <laughs> And then it was time for me to do my meetup and also Gracie did one on the other side of me and we both had so much fun. I also got to see Teddy the Shetland and we had a bit of a catch up too. All right, so we've just finished our meetup. I'm here with Gracie, Pony Nuts. How did the meetup go? It was good, yeah. It was so good to be back, like doing it again after. So this is your like first, first meetup one after since like COVID and stuff. I think it's Olympia. Oh my goodness. That was, so, that was the last time I saw you. Yeah. That was so long ago. I know. So. I can't believe we haven't caught up since then. I know. It's but it's been good. Been busy. Yeah. Yes. There was quite well, a lot of people. There was. Yeah. It was so like two many. hours of meeting people. Yeah. So. But it, was, it was so good. And just like seeing people's faces again and like smiling. Yeah. It's so just, much different. Oh, like it's so much fun. Online. And like the amount of people that came up to me and were like, I started riding because of you. Like it blows oh, my mind. It's so sweet. No, that's so. And when you see them in your merch. Yeah. No, that's the bit. It's that really gets surreal. Me. It's still. Oh yeah. my gosh. When I saw when I see the merch, I literally want to cry. That's the moment for me. Um, but yeah, I got a demo now. Yeah, you everything. better rush off, get I'm Todd ready. I'm gonna go get Todd ready for my Enjoy. demo. Hopefully I'll do okay. Thanks, uh, that's yeah. me. See, See ya. ya, bye. And then it was time for the show to begin. We kicked it off with Anna Miller, the dressage rider, showing us some awesome moves on her absolutely gorgeous horse, who also met Teddy the Shetland as well on the way out. After that, it was then Teddy's time to hit the stage. Alice did a brilliant demo explaining how she trains Teddy, as well as talking to us a little bit more about the amazing therapy work that Teddy does. 
After that, it was then time for Gracie to get on Todd and have a lesson with Yaz Pynchon. So it was time for Teddy to walk out. But obviously on the way, Teddy had to say hi to Todd. Gracie's demo with Yaz she did some grid work and oh my goodness her and Todd as a partnership they just look so good together so that was really fun to watch then it was Yaz's turn to ride Tommy a stallion owned by Liam Payne and I definitely think the show jumping was a firm favorite with the crowd next it was my turn to enter stage and I did a Q&A with all of your questions from Instagram after me was the vaulting team and oh my goodness some of the stuff that they were doing was just absolutely absolutely mind-blowing so I had a really lovely chat with them all backstage as well and um, there might be a challenge as me vaulting at some stage in the works I don't think I'll be doing anything as spectacular as this but I think it would be a lot of fun before the day ended I also had to get lots of scratches and cuddles in with Teddy as well and one very brave member of Pony magazine got dressed up in the Charlie suit because it was then time for Teddy and and Charlie head on head to have a race together and of course in all his glory Teddy the Shetland did win all right so after being at Merris Wood and having one of the best times ever catching up with everybody such as Gracie Teddy the Shetland and all of the team from Pony Honestly, I had so much fun and I can't wait for the next one. Hopefully there'll be another one. Um, and on, on meeting you guys as well, it was just, you guys are always so lovely and it, every single one of you brought a smile to my face. So thank you so much everybody to coming, <laughs> coming for that. And Duke is giving me a bit of a lick attack. Would you like another treat? I think you would love another treat. So the next day was also very busy because as soon as I finished up at Merris Wood at the Pony Big Day Out, it was then time to drive all the way to Blenheim and go to that the next day. So I had another very early start, getting ready, up for that. And again, Blenheim was just awesome. <laughs> Okay guys, I've just had the most surreal time here at Boodles. They have very kindly allowed me to wear some of their beautiful jewellery today um, for the day while I'm here at the show. And oh my goodness, this is the Rain Dance collection, which is just gorgeous. And all the jewellery I'm wearing now is worth more than all of my horses combined with all of my tack, all of my camera gear. So um, I better not lose anything today because that would not be great. But everything is just absolutely stunning so yeah off to a great start this morning <laughs> So that slightly bizarre last clip you saw was me, Greg James and Chris Smith 
pretending to be dressage horses or me trying to explain and show them what dressage is all about. But anyway, I had such a fabulous time at Blenheim and hopefully I'll be back again next year because it is such a spectacular show. Not only did I watch the show jumping that day, but also the eight and nine year old um, cross country uh, four star short, which was so awesome. Also, again, I met so many of you guys, so much so that I had to do a second meetup. So apologies for everybody that had to wait so long, but it was just so lovely meeting you all. Duke here is, you sniffing Mickey's grooming kit? Does it smell like Mickey? Yes. Um, I also got to go to Boodles where I was wearing pretty much like a whole house deposit worth of diamonds that, don't worry, I didn't lose any and I did give them back. Uh, but it was really fun to wear those for the day and also just sit and watch the show jumping as well. It was all so amazing. Um, but anyway guys, I'm going to finish off today's video here while Duke is enjoying his scratchies. Yes! And I'm going to do some handling with you, yes? Thank you so much for watching today's video. If you're new or have not done so already, please like and subscribe because it really does help me out and I really do appreciate it and I'll see you all next time. Bye!